Hello and welcome to Pabli. In this video, we are going to understand how to send SMS for Wix form submission automatically. So here my objective is every time I have received a new lead through form submission in Wix, which is a website builder software, then automatically an SMS must be sent to the new lead. And to do this, we are going to use Click Send as an application, which is a business communication software. Now to do this, we'll have to set up some integration between Wix and ClickSend. And we can do the same using Pabli Connect. So here my trigger will be Wix and my action application will be ClickSend. Now you can integrate and automate this entire process yourself. To understand how, let's begin. So this here is a dashboard of Pabli Connect software and you can reach here by clicking on the link which is given in the video description. If you are an existing user, sign in. And if you are the new user, you will have to sign up. It is not going to take more than two minutes. And yes, at the time of account creation, you will get 100 free tasks. Now, once you reach the dashboard, on the right hand side, there's a tab create workflow. Click on this. And this dialog box has appeared where you have to name this workflow. You can give any random name. I'm going to name it as per my objective, which is to send SMS for Wix form submission. Now here I'm going to click on create and as we do that here we have reached another window which has got two extremely important events. One here is trigger, another one is action. Now triggers and actions are basically those two principles or concepts on which this entire automation works. Trigger is when this happens, action says do this. Basically action here is the automated response of our trigger application. Now let's understand this with the help of an example. So every time you swipe your card and the payment is made, then you get an automated response on SMS or WhatsApp about the amount debited. Now this happens with the help of automation and in such a case, your trigger will be the payment gateway and your action application will be any application with which you can send these SMS and messages. Now let's come to our use case. So here my trigger the application here will be Wix forms. Let's click on this and the trigger event. So the trigger event is the event that is going to make this workflow run. And here it will be new form submission. Now here we have received this webhook URL. Now this URL is going to act as a bridge for connecting Wix forms with Pabli Connect. So I'm going to copy this. Now, once we do that, we have to follow the following steps. So these steps are required to connect Wix forms with Pabli Connect. Now let me show you exactly what you have to do. So this here is my Wix account. Here, first of all, we have to go to automations and now I'm going to click on new automation. So here I'm going to search by name. So it is test automation. So here I'm going to start from scratch. Now, first of all, I'm going to name it as test automation because there was no previous automation like that. So here I'm going to now choose a trigger. The trigger will be Wix forms. Now here we have to select a trigger form submitted or choice selected on a form. So the trigger is form submitted. Now select which forms trigger this automation. So here I want a specific form. So I have already created a contact form. So I want that particular form to be here. Then limit frequency too. So I do not want to limit. So I've left it just like this. Then we have to choose the action application. So here I'm going to choose send via webhook. The request type is post payload type is application JSON. Now this URL that we had received, I'm going to copy this and here I'm going to paste the same. All keys and values. So here we are going to send all the fields from the trigger. Now I'm going to click on activate. And as we do that, we can see our new automation is now active. Taking you back to Pabli Connect. Now here it is waiting for webhook response. Basically what we have to do now, we have to do a test submission so that the data can be recorded here in the webhook response. Now to check whether Wix and Pabli Connect are properly integrated or no, we are going to do this test submission. Taking you back to Wix. Now here you can see communications. Within communications, we have forms and submissions. Let's click on this. Now here you can see the contact form that we have created. I'm going to open the form. And now as I take you down, here is the form right in front of us. So let's fill up the form. Let's say the first name is smart. The last name is user one. This here is the email address. Then we have the phone number, which is plus nine one. Then we have the address. Now we have to type your message. So let's say this is just a test message. Now I'm going to click on submit. 
and here we can see our form has been submitted taking you back to Pabli Connect you can see we have received the response here this here is the submission time then we have the ID here we have the form name form ID then here we have the message address mobile number email address last name and first name so once we have received all this information what is my objective i want to send an sms to this new lead so here i'm going to choose my action application as click send let's click on this and the action event here will be as i take you down send sms now i'm going to click on connect here Pavli Connect wants to connect with click send account. I'm going to select add new connection because we are setting up this connection for the first time. Now here we have to enter the username and API key. To receive this first we have to log in to our click send account. I have already done that and then click on the developers menu on the down left. So this here is my click send account and here we have developers. We have API credentials. Now here you can see this here is the username and then we have the API key. So I'm going to copy the API key, go to Pabli Connect, paste the same here. Then we need the username. So this here is the username. I'm going to copy this, go back to Pabli Connect and paste the same here. Now I'm going to click on save to set up this connection. And here you can see that click send and Pabli Connect are now connected. Now here we have to enter this information. First of all, the number. So I want to here enter the number of the new lead. To do that, I'm going to go to the first step. And this here is the mobile number. Always remember that the mobile number is to be written with the country code and the plus sign. And this method with which I have added the information here is known as mapping. This is important so that every time your workflow runs, it can take the new data into consideration. Now, let's say that I had written this number manually. Then in that case, even when I had received a new lead with some new phone number, it wouldn't have taken that. Instead, it would have taken the same number. So to avoid this, we map the information. Next is from so here we have to enter a clicks and dedicated number so here if you have purchased a number you can just enter the same here i'm going to leave it blank next we have the message so i'm going to write dear and now i'm going to map the name of the person which is smart let's give a space and user one now here the message that i have written is your form has been successfully submitted we will connect with you shortly to discuss your specifications. Meanwhile, you can check out our website, which is this regards. Now you can always customize this message. You can write anything you want to send to your customer. Now this here is just a test message. So when you are framing your own message, you can have all the specifications that you want as per your objective. Now here you have to enter the scheduled time so time must be in unix format leave blank for immediate delivery now if you want to schedule this then you can schedule it at a particular time the time has to be in this particular format i'm going to leave it blank as i want a quick delivery then we have the custom string and here we have the source since we had received our lead through wix form so here i have entered wix forms now i'm going to click on save and send test request and as I do that, here we have received the response, which says that this message has been successfully sent. And here it is written that the message is queued for delivery. So now let me show you if we have received this SMS. And here you can see that we have received our SMS. So this basically means our integration is a success. Now let's quickly check the same in real time. So I'm going to take you back to Wix forms. And here I'm going to open the form once again. And let's fill up the form. Let's see the first name is dummy. The last name is new one, two, three. Then we have the phone number and then we have the address. Let's say the message is demo message. And now I'm going to click on submit and our form has been submitted. And here you can see as soon as this form has been submitted automatically, I have received this SMS. So this means our integration is a complete success. Taking you back to Pabli Connect, let's quickly understand what we have done. So here our trigger was Wix forms where the event was new form submission and our action application was click send where the event was to send SMS. I hope this is absolutely clear to you. If in case you have any doubt, you can refer to the workflow which is given in the video description. You can also clone the same and start to process immediately. Apart from this, if you have any specific integration to work on, you can always write to us.
Not only this, but you can integrate multiple applications using Pabli Connect software. To ask any of your query, you have to write at forum.pabli.com. You can also visit our website, which is www.pabli.com slash connect. To get all the details about the latest updates, the integrations and applications, you can visit our Facebook group. If in case you have found this video helpful, then do not forget to share this with your friends and colleagues so that they can also get into automation and make their life easy. I'm going to see you very soon with different integrations and automations. Do not forget to like, share and subscribe. Take care of yourself.